baby steps to us mass. Today we're going to take a look at Isaiah 9, the King of Kings. Man, I love this passage. Welcome to Bible Shorts. My name is Nate, and I have been teaching through 25 different Bible verses for Advent. And here we are, day 25. Merry Christmas. Let's look at the scripture. It's Isaiah chapter 9, verse 6. Here's what it says. For to us a child is born, to us a son is given, and the government will be on his shoulders, and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Good news is the best news, and that is precisely what God had promised through the prophet Isaiah. Jesus is that promised child. He was born of a woman. He was a human man. Jesus is the Son who was given, the only begotten Son of God. He was given by God to us. Jesus is a gift. Remarkable, the gift of God himself born into the world to save us. Jesus is a king. Actually, he is the king. That's why the prophet said that the government would be upon his shoulders. Everybody will serve a king. Either you are your own king for now, or you serve Jesus. Here's a promise straight from scripture. One day, every knee will bow to King Jesus. Jesus represents you before God. He is our wonderful counselor. He advises, assists, helps, and aids. That's a pretty big deal. Don't overlook it. When was the last time you stood before God on behalf of yourself? Exactly. Jesus is God the Son and the Son of God. He is our mighty God. He is mighty in power, deed, love, and grace. It's precisely why he can stand before God on our behalf. Did you know that there are no orphans in Christ's kingdom? Jesus is our everlasting father. He is a father to all who come to him forever. Let that sink in. No human can reign without the military capacity to protect his rule. Jesus is the monarch of mercy and crowned king of resolution. When he whispered, it is finished, it was done. Jesus is our prince of peace. Who is Jesus to you? Trick question. He is everything Isaiah promised and more. The babe born in the manger is your good news. He is God's gift from heaven, but none of that will make a difference in your life until you embrace the truth about Christmas. Jesus came to you so that you would come to him. Here's my Christmas challenge for you today. Write a one sentence declaration of your intention to keep moving toward God. Take it even further. Make it the background on your smartphone. Hey, don't forget to like and subscribe help share this content with more people. Thank you so much for watching these videos over the last 25 days. If you've enjoyed the videos, there's still time to order my brand new book, The Christmas Trail Guide. It's linked in the description below. Get a jump start on Christmas presents for your loved ones for next year. God bless you. Thanks for being here, and I hope that you have a Merry Christmas.